Hi, my name is Balloon Josh. I'm here with ClownAntics.com, and today you're going to learn how to make my quick line work Minnie Mouse balloon that everyone loves. So this is going to be my character head design. Now, I love versatile designs that can easily be changed to create many different things and not just one design. So this design I'm about to teach you, I think is perfect for a lot of the kids' uh, favorite cartoon characters right now. So for example, if you do it in these colors, it's very easily Sonic the Hedgehog. So this is what I would do for my Sonic. Or if you do it this way, it's the exact same balloon. It's twisted the exact same way. All I did was change the colors a little bit, add a bow, and now it's Hello Kitty. Couple changes, the exact same balloon, made the exact same way, it's now Pikachu. Couple more changes, exact same balloon, exact same design, it's now Minnie Mouse. Take off the bow, it's Mickey. This can also very be very easily be changed into a very quick Paw Patrol. So this is the uh, my character balloon that we're gonna be learning. We're gonna need a peach blush, we're going to need a white scrap and we're going to need a black balloon. We'll start with the peach blush. You're going to want to leave roughly a, hand, a little bit more than a hand width or four to five inches uninflated. You're going to start with a loop twist and take the knot, pull it through, and then we're going to do two more loop twists. So you have three identical loop twists. Then we're going to make a roughly a hand sized bubble. These are going to be Mickey's head and followed by a one inch pinch twist, and then bring it back down, tie it around the base of those three loop twists, and then you have the foundation for Mickey's head. Now we need to attach his eyes. This is a white scrap. It doesn't matter how long or how much is uninflated because you don't need very much. So take the knot and you tie the knot around the base of the loop twist, and then you're gonna take it up and tie it around the pinch twist at the top of Mickey's head, and then bring it back down, tying it around the loop twists and then break off the excess and then just tuck it into the head. So here you have Mickey's head and his eyes. Now we need to add the black part. So you're going to take the knot and you're going to tie it around the base where the three loop twists are. Then you're going to make roughly a hand sized bubble followed by a small one inch pinch twist. Now we're going to do a loop twist and tuck the pinch twist into the middle of the loop twist, followed by a one inch bubble, and then we're gonna attach that to the pinch twist at the top. That's one side of Mickey's head. So now we do it again, we do a one inch bubble, followed by a small one inch bubble, which turns into a pinch twist. Then we do a small loop twist, and we're going to tuck the pinch twist into the loop twist, then a bubble that's a little bit wider than our hand, and that ties to the base where those three loop twists are. We tuck that around. Now here's where it gets tricky. We want to break this off, but save it. We don't want to throw it away. So we break it off, hold it, let go of the part that's on the head, and then we want to leave just a little bit because this is going to be Mickey's cute little nose. So we squeeze out the air, pinch it off, let go. Then you have to retie it, and you want Mickey's nose. Then you're going to tuck that through the loop twist on the front, and then you pull it out the bottom, and then you're gonna wrap that around the head and tuck it inside. And that gives you a very cute Mickey head. It's also very quick. Now for the eyes, I like drawing the eyes the way they were originally drawn way back in the black and white when Mickey first came out. And they gave him these Pac-Man shaped eyes, which I think work actually great, not just for Mickey, but for most characters. It's a very easy way to draw eyes that also looks very animated, um, and it's a really cute look. And a lot of people don't draw them that way anymore. And then for the mouth, give a nice smiley mouth. Make sure you draw the tongue in there. And there's a very quick and fun Mickey Mouse head. So this right now looks a lot like Mickey Mouse, but wait, all we have to do is add a bow. So we take this pink balloon, we do a loop twist, we tuck the knot through, pull it out, then we do a pinch twist, or another loop twist, sorry. 
And then we're gonna do a pinch twist. And this is gonna be our pretty little pink bow for Minnie Mouse. And we're just gonna break off the extra because you don't need it. Let go of that. And then you need a little bit left because that's what you're gonna tie to the pinch twist at the top of Minnie's head. So right now it kind of looks like Mickey, but now once we put the bow on, we quick add the bow, tuck it in. And then we have our pretty bow for Minnie Mouse. But just to make her look even more like Minnie Mouse, I forgot, need to add the eyelashes. And then she really stands out away from Mickey and she is Minnie Mouse. Thank you so much for watching. All of the products used are listed down below. Please remember to like this video if you'd like to see others like it. We hope to see you again. Have a wonderful day.